Yeah. Okay. Ready, Sasha? Well, Dave, this is a very exciting fan fest. And today we received the special news that number 34 is being retired. What's your reaction to hearing that? It's about time. No, I'm kidding. Uh, you know, it, it's one of those things I was talking to some people earlier is when you think of the Dodgers at 34, you think of Fernando, and everyone does. So to finally make it official um, at FanFest, have all these Dodger fans here, Fernando here, I think it was so apropos, so special. And, uh, you know, this is a man that changed, really impacted a fan base, not only with his play on the field, but more importantly, if you can say even more importantly, off the field. And so I'm just so grateful and happy that I could be here for that moment. This is the first fan fest since 2020. What is it like being around all of these fans and sharing this day with them? These are things that I know, speaking for the players, that we love because, you know, once you get into the grind of a season, you don't have that access. They don't have that access. So to kind of be able to shake hands, have conversations, feel that energy that's been two, three years uh, in the making, in the come, you know, in the come. Uh, it's been great because uh, these guys out there are just fanatical. They're, they're the best fans in sports. So for me to be a part of it just makes me that much more excited about spring training. Yeah, and it's coming literally around the corner now. Are you ready? It's coming. We're, we're, we're almost done with football. Um, so I can't wait to get out to Glendale. And we've got, I mean, gosh, we've got a dozen, a couple dozen players already there at Camelback Ranch getting after it. Um, I looked at these guys from Alex Vesia, Phillips, Austin Barnes, uh, you know, Gonsolin, um, Syndergaard. They're already there, ready to go. So it's going to be a fun year. Yeah, and Doc, you had one of the most iconic, memorable stolen bases of all time. I want to get your thoughts on these new rules that encourage base stealing and how big is it for the game? It, it's huge for the game. I, I think that, you know, as a manager, my job is to give ourselves the best chance to win a baseball game. Uh, what the rules have done is it's it's going to speed up the game, which is what the fans want. It also gives us an opportunity to have more of a dynamic player. So we're going to get to see more balls in play, more hits, uh, because we can't shift. And then also the stolen base. There's a bigger base. Base are a little bit bigger. Uh, the throwing over is going to be minimized. And so hopefully, that bat to ball is going to increase. It's also more of a dynamic player. So for me, that was my game. So we have to still get players that can do that. Um, I'm not going to have Freddie Freeman stealing bases just yeah. because uh, we can steal more. But I like the way the game's going. Yeah, and as an elite base stealer, do you think you have one more stolen base in you? Absolutely not. Um, no. I, I, I got to get a good jump, but the thing is, though, I can't get out of first gear anymore. That's the problem. All right, thanks, Dave. Appreciate it. One of my, well, I wasn't there for this, but to see a woman come up there and, and on the field and kiss Fernando, uh, is amazing, but I will tell you this, my best uh, story is uh, I had an at-bat in an alumni game, so I was here and he pitched, so that was one of my biggest thrills. I didn't get a face of when we were players, but I got an unofficial at-bat versus Fernando Valenzuela, so that's a highlight. And I grounded out, so I'm 0 for 1 career. <laughs> You know, it's it's one of those things that Fernando is is one of the most uh, humble guys you'll ever gonna come across. Um, doesn't like the attention, doesn't need the attention. Never been a self promoter, um, but I do think that how loyal he's been to the Dodgers and for the Dodgers to reciprocate by giving him the ultimate compliment and re reward by retiring the number, that just speaks to legacy and, and gratitude on both sides. So, again, I could be happier for, we did it right. The Dodgers did it right, and I'm happy for Fernando.